Hello and welcome back to me playing Oxygen Not Included. In the last episode, I sent Pilot over to this world. And they were able to set up a little bit of uh, oxygen production and food. Two key things that you need for the dupes, food and oxygen. In addition to that, I'm going to get them to actually start to build a base with some comforts to up morale for the dupes that are here. And I also had to think about what I'm going to do with missing thimble reed seed. Because that none exists on this asteroid that I've teleported to. At least I don't uh, think that's going to be the case. I'm, I'm almost certain. And neither is in the home world. Got eight dupes over here. Not ready to take on another one. Unless I had one stellar dupe. I don't see that. So what I'm going to do is uh, build a rocket and telescope, explore out here, and get to an asteroid that I can get some thimble reed seeds because I want ammo suits built. So anyways, I will get a plan together and we'll start to uh, move along with this project. So dupes in this world is, are looking for something to do. So what I'm going to do is build a new place to put on gas masks. We're going to need the help of the dupe that can big th dig through a bisolite. Last episode, we put this together. We're growing these spindle grub fruit, uh, grub fruit plants. It's producing more food. We get 48,000 calories, doing healthier than we did uh, last episode. Stoop over here. I'm going to get them to create some rooms. Be nice to make a washroom and a place to eat. Get a great hall. Continue digging down. So get make sure they are uh, kept busy over the next little while. But we're not going to go down here into the 80 temp degrees plus area until we have some uh, protective suits to be worn. construction over here I see is started. So I want more than five stations like I had last time. Actually I might even make it so all eight dupes can get to the top if they want to. So I may have certain surges of uh, activity to do a construction up here. So if that's going to be the case I need eight tiles plus two more if I want to have ladder. And a fire pole. So now that I've got this carved out a bit, I can put in oxygen, ma oxygen mask stations. We're gonna have eight. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're gonna need to provide oxygen to this. We have an oxygen line right here. We've lost our barracks status, I'm just realizing. So we're going to create a cot over here. Once we have that caught and return the barracks, so maybe we'll hold off on digging that for the moment. But uh, when we, once we have that, we can unlock this guy and have another dupe because there's lots of work that could be done over on this asteroid. This dupe here has been busy. They've got lots to do, but I've got another caught, so I'm going to defrost a friend. So we're going to get this dupe, first of all, to come up here. Um, move to come on up here. We're gonna save the game. So I want to choose the type of skills that I have to some degree. Saving eighty 
before. Just in case I don't like the selection. That, oh, I don't even have a selection. I think you just get uh, one dupe. Whatever their skills and interests are, they are what they are. But I can always reload and it will generate a new option for me. Let's see what... Uh, shabby dresser bump. Oh, here we are. Suit wearing, supplying, and doctoring. I generally don't like interest of doctoring. So find dupes don't get uh, injured or sick that often. But suit wearing supply is pretty decent. Uh, shabby dresser. What's what's their positive trait? Ancient knowledge. Do they not have a positive trait? associate with them I guess that maybe that's just because of the ancient knowledge okay whatever let's bring them I'll call them doctor I'm not going to accept any other dupes that have doctoring skills so that's at least two dupes that can do some construction here We need one of them to have the ability to dig, dig through granite. We're gonna have to create some rooms as well. Create one of the barracks over here. Hold on, just realizing I should probably count for nature reserve. I guess this, this design is fine. But I uh, don't see a lot of plants over here, so I'm going to have the nature reserve over this side. Plan that in. Check on the dupes over here. They're just about starting the process of installing the gas mass stations. Let's tell the dupes that we need a few more of these. I'll create five more. Looking pretty good dupes. We've got these gas mass stations. Is there any way to deliver more than one at a time? Be a nice, handy thing to have. Or even just to have that maybe deliver suit by default. I don't know, that kind of makes sense to me. Oops. So, but anyway, we'll have uh, eight of those mask stations available. Let's enable this building. So that forces the dupes to put them on when they go through this hydrogen area. We're going to build a rocket. Actually, hold on. I think we should do the telescope first. But I would rather, I'm assuming there is radiation. It's fairly safe. Yeah, let's not uh, give them a normal telescope. Let's give them a protected telescope. I think it's going to cut the radiation uh, absorption by 50% when dupes are in there. Telesco, there it is there. Enclosed telescope, so we've got to research that first and then we'll be able to construct that. Meantime, why don't we bring more water to this area from our various water caches down here, for instance. I'm going to have to cross this thing here to make that happen. So we're going to have a line go up here. It's going to go up here. 
and that connects into this. So we had that water cache over here. We're going to get rid of that pump. Might as well mop up the little bit of water that was left. Not ready for a new dupe. These dupes are still busy. So we're going to use our cutting tool right here. To make a cut like this and that. And then you have the liquid bridge go over like this. Actually, you know what? Let's just do this. Another liquid bridge right there, and then we can just connect this guy, do another liquid bridge. And that should be fine. You know, I did that and there isn't really that much water to do, but uh, there, there is a bit of water that we can get over there. Okay, so now I have to decide what I want where. We need a barracks, a place to eat, and a washroom. I think I can get most of the stuff over this side just because it's going to have a nature reserve that may be ideal. So we're going to remove move the barracks to be up here. Let's put our eating area down here and perhaps a washroom at this location. I have to worry about the carbon dioxide to some degree, but uh, I, I can dig down for a little bit and that will allow that uh, to settle down. With a new dupe, I have to start producing more food. I'm going to plan for five of these per dupe. like research is still on the way for scientists to create an enclosed telescope but we should get that soon actually I know one of the things that enclosed telescopes gonna need is oxygen so let's just go ahead and bring that oxygen line up Back. there's the research being complete oh and there must have been one research before that one so that's good. we're gonna need power as well. Check on the pip condition. I've got six, four. So two is missing in one room. So I want to wrangle two more of these guys. And then those rooms will be full. Just check on a few. Oh, overcrowded. Whoa, 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 whoa. Overcrowded. Why is this? We've got six. Maybe the room's not big enough. I think it's what one, two, three, four, five. Ah, okay, we were off by one. Let's dig this out. Not gonna get a lot of eggs that way if we don't make this room big enough. What's the total size? 72, we could even go bigger. Just to temporarily allow for eggs to be put in here. Though I could put in automation to remove the eggs. I'm 
I want to be cautious about digging too far this way just because it is quite warm. So I might actually add insulation wall right there. Don't need to bother with the abyssalite. a bunch of doors down here to create for future rooms to add to morale. So the top one is a place to sleep. We're going to have a place to eat in the middle one. And this is going to be the washroom and showers. And of course, this is going to connect over here and give us access to a nature reserve. So lots to be done. No point in having these doors closed. Actually, the ones here maybe because I don't want shine bugs to get too close to the bed. Actually, that they're far enough away anyway. We're okay. Did I hear research be uh, complete? I must have because it's asking me to do more research. So let's go to rocketry and close telescope. Big object. We get to pump that way in with uh, oxygen. That's this line right here. So I'll let the dupes catch up on some of the work and we'll be back to keep advancing on. Dupes here will have a place to eat. If I give them uh, two mess tables, one for each of them, I'll give them a flower pot. If I plant this guy here, a bluff blair, I'll even be able to make this a great hall. See if we have water flowing up. We do not yet. Oh, because uh, because this one's out. Can destroy that. And mop up the little bit of water that's around. Now turn our attention to this guy here. Dun, dun. One thing I would like, wish they had, is ability to reverse this without having to destroy it and rebuild it. Maybe there'll be a switch function or a button to do that. They have a space for a button right there. It says switch direction. Wouldn't that be nice? Anyway. The way to do it now is just to destroy it. Wait for one of the dupes to take it out and then put in the other one. So that should send all the water up here. In the meantime, I'm going to put connectors here and here. And that's going to bring polluted water here to be treated. I want to slow that down. Let's try 500 grams a second. Let's give us some uh, extra rations. They would actually be good on a space mission, actually, because that never goes bad. Quality of life will slowly get better over here and create more rooms for these dupes to use during their break. How are they doing for morale? Decent. Let's give Pilot her digging. Just to keep not sure what skill I'm going to want the dupes to be able to have just yet, so I might hold on assigning those just yet.
So gas mass stations are on, almost created our enclosed telescope. So once that telescope is created, we can even go ahead and create a spot for the rocket. One thing to be, whoops, one thing to be mindful is while the dupes are going up and down this ladder, they're going to be absorbing radiation. So one thing we can do is put tiles here. Actually, I don't know if that's going to affect the telescopes. Maybe I'll wait for that to be fully used, but we'll have uh, we'll have that protection there in time. And we'll build a rocket. Do I have the research for a rocket? Doesn't look like it. Even though I have a rocket control station. Oh no, I just don't have the metal. Never mind. Never mind. I need a metal refinery. I could create that in a rock crusher. But let's not do that. Oil is so close. But because it's so hot, it is so far away from me right uh, now at this time. So down here, keep the, make sure these dupes don't stay idle. They're going to want to make a shower. Have a place to wash their hands and a sink. And of course, a lavatory. To see if there's an actual source of water kicking around this asteroid and never actually look for it. There's a little bit here. And uh, that's ethanol. So there, oh, a little bit over here, not too much. But maybe I'll dig and get access to this. Maybe time now for that uh, metal refinery. So I'm gonna let all the dupes go in here. We'll put in a metal refinery. We'll have a storage bin to contain the inputs to the metal refinery. Let's put in a dupe sensor. And light. Hook up automation wire across the two. Create more glass. One thing I may, I was going to eventually do is bring glass over here and then build uh, solar panels. I'm worried about asteroids though. Oh wow, crushed ice. Is that new? Was that from an asteroid? That. Yeah, there's some over here. Is it possible that we had, let's see if that's actually significantly colder, minus eight, not necessarily. Was that already there? I'm suspicious about that fact. If that turns to liquid, it's just going to uh, be lost, though I'm not really that concerned. So I should be able to create a nature reserve now. That's going to be furniture, park sign. Put that right there. Create a door in front of this area. Put a door right here. Create some ladders. Get rid of these cots to make sure the bed relocates to this room where they're going to cross the nature reserve every day, every morning when they go to bed, as well as when they eat. You need to think about food storage as well. I don't see any natural areas that are really cool. So what I might do is just put it in a fridge and make sure that's stored in carbon dioxide area. Maybe we'll do that over here on the left side of the eating area.
could store it down here, lots of carbon dioxide. This liquid now is dry. Okay, so let's destroy that pump. Let's mop that up. And get the du dupes to uh, dig in there. Now, I've got this line going up. Uh, the lines here for the oxygen are empty. Not ideal, but I, I can fix that easily enough. I'm going to... Let's see. I'm going to need a liquid bridge, and we're going to output water from here. So the water from the overall base is going to be stored here, and it's going to be pushed out. It's going to go through the washroom first, and then out in two directions, up and down from here. And it's going to hit all the electrolyzers. Over here, we're going to need... What was this? This is the polluted water. It's a different line. This one is going to reach this guy here. Oh, right. i just get rid of that to make it more clear that it ends there with this uh, electrolyzer. Time to put our finishing pieces on our metal refinery. So that's the metal refinery itself. It's going to need some power. Gonna probably try to avoid running both the glass forge and the metal refinery at the same time because they both take so much power. But this is gonna need liquid cooling in and out. So we need a liquid source that's gonna stay cool. Worried about the these ones because uh, they're minus 10, 11, but it's not gonna take long to warm those up. That may not actually be a bad thing though reason for that is I actually want to bring this above freezing to use it as to put to convert to regular water that needs to be above zero for oxygen snazzy suit who's gonna get that one here package Uh, da, da. Let's give that to Miner. Okay, let's put in a pump. Let's do that. This We're going to use this liquid here for the cooling. Notice this guy here is overpressured. Let's dig out some spot for that to uh, output some more liquid. Still a little bit of room over here on this one. New planetoid detected. Oh, it's not going to take me to the star map. Let's go to the star map. This one over here, Glovia Bow. Metallic Caves. It's metal poor though. Um, we've got a lot of metal or gold, cobalt, anyways, uh, volcano polluted water. Oxalite meteor shower, strange, okay. But what's the biomes? I Swamp biome, that's... Swamp, I'm assuming that's going to be, if I can see, swampy marsh. Yep, this is what I want here, because we'll get access to the, these little plants. And two dupes are idle. No point in having them sit there with nothing to do. Let's get them digging. We'll create a pump down here and we'll have access to water. I'm going to create a spot for a fridge as well. It's going to go right there. I'll have to increase the power situation though. So I want a power room. Getting morale high enough so I can give these dupes different skills, like electronic engineering. So 
Still need to dig out more polluted water area here. Or... Oh, if I hit this one, it's going to drop all the liquid down here. I think there is a good chance these two liquids are going to meet. I'm not overly concerned about that happening. Especially since this, uh, there's ice that's going to be melting one day anyway. But what I want to do is build a pump up here to take to the oil refinery and then dump the heated up liquid from it over here. Normally I think that I would look this as quite daunting going through all of this, but with the new cut button, I think it's going to be much easier. So I'm going to do that in the next episode. So in this episode, we are in, uh, advancing this space. Let's double check that we've got rooms here. We've got, yeah, we do a barracks, a great hall, a washroom, and a nature reserve. So I'm going to feel much more comfortable about getting the dupes to have more skills. It's going to create a ladder right here. And we'll have place to do deal with bleach stone. But now that I've got way at the top of here a telescope, I've got scientists using it. They've got. Uh, my, should I be worried about the, them getting radiation poisoning? Seem to be fine right now. But if I need, I'll put a clock there to disable it so it can't. They can't use it all day long, but I'll just see what kind of mileage I get from scientists while they're up there. Trying to figure out what asteroids exist, but this one's perfect. This is probably, this is definitely the one that I want to go to next anyway. Well, I am going to finish there for tonight, but tomorrow, or, or not necessarily tomorrow, but next time, I'm going to be building a rocket and sending someone over to that asteroid. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in a future episode.